I'm Tammy Melchok. We begin tonight here at 5 with the man we are now realizing could be one of the most prolific and brutal killers in Kern County history. This man is charged with five counts of murder in three separate incidents. He was in court today facing a judge on his latest charges. 17's Amber Frias joins us now with the details. Samber. 45-year-old Louis Perez pleaded not guilty to two counts of first-degree murder today. His latest charges allege he killed two men whose bodies were found June 13 in a grapevine near Arvin. According to court documents, the two victims, 42-year-old Samuel Atkinson and 79-year-old Vincent Paul Valdez, were bound and beaten on the head with a blunt object. Their throats were cut and bodies set on fire. A few days later, one of the victims' cars was found. Inside, authorities found a badly dented baseball bat with blood on it. According to court documents, DNA testing linked Perez to the bat. Perez was already in custody during this time, being held on other charges. He had been held without bail since September, September 5th in connection with the gruesome murder of Victor Manuel Vasquez, whose body was found in a bathtub in a southwest Bakersfield apartment. Additionally, Vasquez faces murder charges and the death of Selena Sanchez and Jesse James John. Their bodies were found October 6th at, the, at a home in Lomita Drive. Perez could face a death penalty if convicted. Also, just into our newsroom, sheriff's officials say they're looking for 29-year-old Edward Diaz, wanted in connection to the two killings in the Great Vineyard. If you know where he is, call the sheriff's department at 861-3110. Amber Frias, 17 News.